Hey guys, so this tutorial today is more of a demonstration than a tutorial, I suppose. Recently I started a new website called freetwitterheaders.com and it's just a site where you can go and download some pictures, some designs for the new Twitter header image feature that they released about a month ago. And what I've been doing lately is just a lot of designing for that. And I decided to release a little template that I've been using that helps me kind of see where everything is and it makes it a lot easier to design headers. So in this template file right here, you've just got a plain black background right now. I've also included um, a couple of colors. I've got a blue and then a red. And then also inside the images, there's the Golden Gate Bridge picture, um, a sunrise picture I took, and then a picture of a Lamborghini. And then I also have some simple gradients, a gray, a green, and a blue. So you can download this, the link's in the description. And if you guys wanna create your own header images and then submit them to the website, I'll put them up out there. And what I'll do is I'll create a link. And when you send me an email, you can send it to contact at freetwitterheaders.com. And what I'll do is include your website or your Twitter handle and I'll write on each post where you go to download the files. I'll say thank you to blank whoever sends in the, um, the header image and it'll link to your website or your Twitter so you can get followers, you can get views on your site, whatever you want to do. So here's a few other things that come inside of this template file. If you press command semicolon, it brings up the guides which I'll show you what those do. If you show the contents of your um, of the contents folder, press the little eyeball right there. Basically, it shows up and it's got this box right here and that's where your description goes on your profile. And then this box right here is the, um, the avatar box. And then when you show the text box, it'll show you kind of an example of everything. And for the guides, this one right here is the top of your name. This one right here is the top of your Twitter handle. This one right here is the top of your description. And then here's the bottom of the box, obviously. So this kind of helps me when I'm doing a design to make sure I don't have anything that's going to be directly in the middle of the text or something that's going to be hid hidden by the avatar. And this file is, I believe it's 12... Yeah, 1252 by 626, which is the optimized size for um, Twitter headers in general because that's the largest size you'll get, which is on the iPad Retina display. So if you guys do any cool designs, let me know. Post them up online. Tweet us. The, the Twitter handle for the website is at freetwitheaders. So just go ahead and feel free to tweet us, follow us. Um, subscribe to my channel here and I'll probably post some tutorials on some of the headers that I've made. But for now, here's this template file. The link's in the description once again. And let us know if you guys create any cool Twitter headers. Thanks for watching.